Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, numbers in the restaurant sector. Ah, uh, numbers looking good in the restaurant sector there, boss. Restaurants are buying lots of soap all the time. <laughs> all right, what right day here. How about the private sector? Numbers are great, boss. People are still buying salt, salt every day. Superb. Well, you're doing a top-notch job, crew. It's just, uh, this thing seems to sell itself. It's not quite why I got in the salt business. I don't think it's why any of us got in the salt business, is it? No. We got in it for the love of salt. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies, let's make salt fun again. Let's think of some more things that we can do with salt, not just put it on food. Come on, we're the top salt people in the country. If we can't do it, nobody can. <laughs> What? Cubicle exfoliator. Oh. Rub it on your fingers, it'll be nice and soft. Oh, oh that's what I'm saying. Uh, 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 a shoe shiner. Rub it on your shoes. Get them shinier. You know, everybody's got shoes. Oh, 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 oh what? At weddings, instead of throwing confetti, you can throw salt. Oh, oh. Then you pick it back up. You pick it back up and you put on your food to save money. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Ladies, 